Now, what about uh, small business enterprises? I mean, what's the entrepreneurial culture like in the Western Cape compared to the rest of the country? I think that's also important, Nick. You know, we run a, um, awards evenings such as Entrepreneur of the Year programs mm -hmm. where we encourage, we have incubator programs, we have a sector-based um, small business approach with, with entrepreneurs mm -hmm. where we have launched Bandwidth Barn. Uh, capacity is a targeted IT um, space where we try and upskill young um, uh, students in IT skills to make them, uh, you know, marketable really in the uh, sector. So we do a lot on working on, inter on, on innovation, on youth unemployment and, um, and job creation. Mm. Could you tell us a little bit more about this uh, red tape reduction unit? Okay. I think that's sort of relevant to, to that. Absolutely. Yeah. So it's also one of the first in the kind in the country, and it really has achieved, um, looking at its recent stats, and we're busy with those annual reports, 95% mm. success rate on unlocking blockages that are hampering particularly small business. But looking at legislation, whether it's visa regulations or whatever it is that is actually stopping business from growing. Mm. And um, I would say that in the last year, this, the majority of those uh, were around tourism with regards to visa regulations, yeah. working with national government at unblocking those spaces. But also visa re regulations that um, are hampering the call center industry hugely because middle managers are struggling to get in from multinational company companies okay. and um, and companies such as Google and Amazon are also struggling within mm. that space. So um, visa regulations has played a large part in our red tape reduction um, focus, but it's also about unblocking all other kinds of legislation um, that just doesn't seem to work for small business. Mm. Beverly, final question, how is the DA working with national government to help bring up the, the national average then? Uh, Nick, you know, behind the scenes, and I think uh, people think of the DA versus the ANC on yeah. everything, it doesn't really always happen like that. And I think our ministers have very good relationships. They are working within a, capa a space called MINMEC, where they meet um, monthly with their national ministers and their counterparts across the country. And it's really about a collaborative approach when it comes to the economy. Um, you know, we, we leave politics where politics belongs, and perhaps with people are, such as myself in the House, uh, where we fight an, on ideology and we debate on those issues. But when it really comes to, uh, for example, the uh, Saldana Industrial Development Zone, um, that is absolutely key for the entire mm. country to make sure that that actually works for South Africa and for the entire country's economy. Okay, thank you very much for your time. Thanks, Nick.